Exodus chapter 14 verses 13 to 14. And Moses said to the people, Do not be afraid. Stand still, and see the salvation of the Lord, which he will accomplish for you today. For the Egyptians whom you see today, you shall see again, no more forever. The Lord will fight for you, and you shall hold your peace. This verse happened right before the Israelites crossed the Red Sea on dry ground. Pharaoh and 600 of his best chariots, most likely with an accompaniment of approximately 15,000 Egyptian infantry, were closing in quickly behind the Israelites. In the heat of the moment, instead of focusing their eyes on the supernatural promise of deliverance they had from Almighty God, they looked at the natural enemy forces that were quickly closing in on them. This caused them to cry out in fear. When faced with the difficult situation of a bad report or sickness, human instinct will naturally incline you to focus on the attack and cry out in fear, especially when it looks as if there's no hope of survival. The Israelites' reaction was based purely on that instinct. Thankfully, Moses' reaction was not, or it could have meant the end of the Israelites. Instead, Moses looked to God and encouraged them to do the same. He urged them to stand still and see, stand firm on and choose to look at God's promise of deliverance. Standing firm on God's promise doesn't mean denying the Egyptian enemy forces are in full attack mode, nor denying the presence of symptoms in your body. It means you choose to keep coming back to his promise no matter what you're experiencing. The fact may be that sickness or disease is affecting you, but those facts are subject to change at any moment. The truth, God's promise which will never change, is that your deliverance from sickness and disease came through the precious blood of Jesus Christ. Stand still on that truth and you will see it happen.